ask voters what worries them, and you'll find jobs ranks near the top of most polls. Politicians often blame trade agreements, regulations, immigration, or workers in other countries for taking jobs. They tend to ignore another disruptive force to the U.S. worker, automation. Automation has been displacing humans for decades. Assembly line workers, switchboard operators, gas station attendants are just some of those whose jobs have disappeared. More recently, jobs in service and retail have taken a major hit. Just think, when was the last time you used a travel agent to book a trip? Or you went to the mall for something you could buy on your phone? For many other types of jobs, the future doesn't look much better. Millions of truck drivers, office employees, and fast food workers could be displaced. But automation is not a zero-sum game. As it eliminates jobs, it creates others. The World Economic Forum estimates 75 million jobs could disappear over the next four years. But it also expects automation to create over 130 million new positions. That's a net gain of nearly 60 million jobs worldwide. The challenge is these new jobs require different skills. Manual labor will matter less. Computer programming and coding will matter more. Millions of American workers don't yet have the training to make this transition to a more automated world. That's one reason policymakers are discussing things like tuition-free colleges and money for lifetime learning programs. They're pushing for high-speed internet for every corner of the country. And they're demanding greater protections for workers in the gig economy. America's history is a story of technological change and adaptation. 100 years ago, the invention of the assembly line and mass production forced American workers to learn new skills. To help them, the U.S. government expanded education. Businesses provided job training, and workers organized in unions to demand higher wages and fair treatment. With automation, Americans and America will again need to adapt. The future of work depends on it.